Elizabeth Street, Little Italy. Hangs with his pals, yeah, that's where he'll be. It's Vinny, a friend of mine. Stand up guy from the Lower East Side. Take it from me, he's one of a kind. It's Vinny, Velotime. Who's better than you? Uh, welcome to the Tell It Like It Is again. Okay. Tell It Like It Is show. And um, Mariana, again, is not here tonight with us, but she'll be back in a couple of weeks. Or actually next week. Yeah, mm -hmm. next week. I'm sorry. And my, my co-host for tonight again, Valeria. Oh, oh, this girl. <laughs> <sighs> I get shortness of breath sometimes. <laughs> you know how to do the mountain to mountain in case they ever faint? I could do that. <gasps> <laughs> but okay. we don't want to do okay, that. Okay, no, I don't want to do that. Right. <laughs> anyway, um, yes. I told everybody a couple of weeks, uh, when was it, last week, that we had a great time in the Hamptons. For Labor yeah, Day we weekend? Yeah, yes. the Labor Day weekend. We were uh, away for, what, four days, Friday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday, Monday, right? Yes. That's right. <laughs> and it uh, cost me a lot of money. Very expensive. She ain't cheap, I'll tell you that much. <laughs> That's a, I didn't mean it that way. But a lot of money. He's a good girl. You're a good girl. And um, and you're a good boy? Yeah. Was I a good boy? You are. I was? Yeah. Or I am? You are. Oh, I am. <laughs> okay, you're right. You're right, baby. I'm you're always right. right. Yeah. Oh, you're right. Uh, let's see. So now, tonight we have the same guest that we had last week yes because she was she was so awesome we decided to invite her a second time right oh, man. oh she was so wonderful yes I, but i have to ask you a question if she brought her boyfriend again this week with her or did she leave him home this week we'll find that out i'm sure we will yes. yeah i'm sure we will yeah. okay <laughs> so, okay yeah. and then i find out which half of these pictures are all about but that's <laughs> another story. the last time i seen it she was an outfit like that yes we'll find well, that we out. won't get into that one okay <laughs> Um, okay, so now, um, but you know, in the audience, I have a friend of mine, JT, then I have my, my guy, Scotty, does a lot of my emails for me and Facebook, you know, all that other stuff. Mm. You know, I'm, I'm still under the rock with all that. You can tell, can't you tell? I got two phones, and I still don't know what the hell I'm doing with them. <laughs> but I know how to call you up. You That's know, right. Yeah, That's right. <laughs> and um, so I got Scotty in the audience, JT Talent. And casting wherever he is, and um, he brought some crowd with him tonight. Where were they? Oh, they're all sitting up there, anyhow. All right, mm -hmm. shh, be quiet while we're doing the show. All right. And JT. Ah. Uh. <laughs> oh, this girl just drives me crazy. You know, every I gotta say one thing. Every time I come on the show and I know that she's gonna be here, I do take a pill. That's uh, calm Why? me down. That's to calm me down. Not that kind of a pill. <laughs> anyway, okay. I have to introduce this wonderful actress again, and what a great singer, and so beautiful, and uh, very talented, very and a great performer and dancer, right. oh. and a model as well. There you go. <laughs> right up my alley. Right <laughs> up my alley. Okay, so we'll introduce her then. Yes. Nana. 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 Nana, give her a nice hand, please. All right. All right. Too cry, I'm standing tall. 
all, baby. Na na na, here we go. Nay nay. Na na. Na na. Na na. Na na. Like shenay nay. Why can't I? Why can't I? Damn, I forget. Um, I'll get it straight. I'll get it straight. Oh wait, I was looking at this now. Now the last time I seen you, I think you had an outfit on like that, right? It was close. Yeah, it was. Am I right? I do remember. It was like a like a ruffles around. Well, the ruffles were actually up here. Oh. Why was I looking down here? I, <laughs> I thought you were down here. It was, it I'm was sorry. You were close, actually. They were pink shorts with a ruffle top. And it was actually, I was dressed by a designer that night. Um, and her name was Chris Barreto. Oh, That's the picture God. I was telling you about. Oh, my God. That I don't is know a if happy anybody Santa could get Claus. a close up of this one. Richard, tell me if you could get a close up of this one. This is when I was on the cover of. Uh, oh, you're missing. <laughs> Is he zooming in yet? No, he, no, can't, he do can't. All right, well, if you cannot get it, it's me as Santa Claus. With a hot blonde. Yeah. <laughs> Eva Herzegova, actually. Huh? Eva Herzegova. Is that, is that her name? Yes. Huh? That's there you a go. very oh, famous that, there you model. Go. Get in a little closer, Richard. Don't worry about me. Just move on, move on in. That's as close as it gets. What? That's as close as it gets. Could, could, were you, and now your phone's done. <laughs> were you, could you see it? I don't know. Yeah, we can see it. You can ah, see it somewhat. Yeah. Okay, what was that <laughs> uh, girl's name again? Eva Herzegova. Eva who? Herzegova, a Czech model, very famous. Very famous model. Yeah, people know her. Oh, boy, oh, boy. <laughs> oh, boy, oh, boy. You want to know something? I'm not getting nasty, but I have wild dreams at night. I'll tell you that much. <laughs> I got some good ones, man. <laughs> oh boy, they don't end. And you know what? You know what? They're so good. I even take naps in the daytime. Just to have them again. Just to have them again. <laughs> You're right. You know. So now, um, this. Could you get a close up of this one, Richard? Because pretty soon we're gonna have um, your video. You have a video. Yes. All oh, right. Okay. Wow, you get the. There you go. So there these are the pictures from your modeling work. No, these are actually for my music photo shoot, and we mm. I did them with a very talented photographer who does J Lo and Rita Orte, mm -hmm. and he does a lot of celebrities. And I was very lucky to work with him on, um, you know, the photo shoot. Hence, he what he's really talented and known for is the colors that he uses mm -hmm. during the shoot and the gels. And the lighting. Yes, it um, looks awesome. Yeah, so he's really good. He is. He is very good. This one's a really nice photo of you, right yeah. there. Yeah, yes, he it's works beautiful. with silks and things like that. And I'm sorry. He works with like silk backgrounds. This one with, was a lot of silk silks. Background. Yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> she likes silk sheets. I know that much. Do you? <laughs> How do you know that? Don't, uh, <laughs> don't, don't answer me questions. You know better than that. <clears throat> anyway, oh wow, so they're all great. They're all great photos. What's this one on the bottom? Ah, this is something that he's also famous for. What he does, he puts this cream or something that sticks on your, you know, that creates your skin to, and then he puts a palette of colors on your on his hand, and then he just blows at your skin, and they, however they fall, they fall. So this is basically organic colors just falling into your skin. He goes like yeah. that, and then they just stick on your stick face. On your face. Wow, unbelievable. So you know, talking about colors and paint and all that stuff. Do you, have you seen on YouTube now? I know I'm not hallucinating, and it was in the papers, <clears throat> where they, I, a guy looked like a bum. Uh huh. Where they, he was running in, running through Times Square naked, and they painted him all over. From they do that a lot with girls too now, which yeah, I thought but was that's funny. Very inappropriate because there's tourists that bring their kids to Times Square, and I know I've mentioned this before on the air, and it, it sh a girl, a little girl, shouldn't happen to see a guy in his underwear playing a guitar, or a little boy seeing a, a girl with her breast out. You know, you know what? On one hand, you're right, but on the other hand, there's a whole movement of people who are nudists. And my I mean, girl... Do, do it somewhere. You got to do it in Times Square. Yeah, that's true. I had a girlfriend of mine, actually. She just Come went to... Come to my house. <laughs> <laughs> My girlfriend, she just went to a beach with this guy on a date, which was really funny. 
and uh, she's very conservative. And she, they go to the beach, and within 30 seconds, he's dropping his pants, and she's like, "What are you doing?" And she looks around, and everybody's naked, and all the families are naked, and the oh kids are God. naked, the whole, and they're playing volleyball, and they're running. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. <laughs> volleyball. Whoa. Wait, the guys were doing the volleyball yeah, or the girls? Yeah, both. Families, kids, and Where she, was this? What beach? In New York somewhere. <laughs> yeah. That's what I said. <laughs> well, you know, when I was down in uh, uh, the Dominican Republic, I was down in Putagana. Okay. And there was all, like, all the... If I would have known it was going to be all these damn kids over there, I would not have picked that place. Right, right. So I didn't want to... And then the, the kids in the... I was right near a restroom, mm. and those kids, I was there for about five on, five hours underneath that umbrella. i never seen those kids get up one time and use that restroom. Oh, that Lord. water stunk. I didn't like Ugh. it. So now, oh, I figured, yeah, and yeah, then yeah. I had a beach ball, and it kept hitting me. I was, I was, I was on a bus. <laughs> I, if I ever had a way to break that freaking thing, I kept saying, oh, excuse me. <laughs> and I was squeezing it like that, trying to bust <laughs> it. So you know what I said? The hell with them. So I went to the beach, uh -huh. and one said, Family and the other one said private. I did not know that's the God's on the shoot. So I naked. went to the private and I'm laying there and I'm taking the sun. Next thing I know is I because I, I wasn't really looking. I just wanted yeah. to park myself. And it was all these beautiful women and some guys that were naked and, and I you know taking off my glasses, I'm checking everything out. <laughs> Next thing you know is my wife tapped me on the shoulder, what are you doing? And I'm taking the sun. She says, "Where? Why are you over here?" I said, "Because I want to. I don't want to be with the kids. I don't want to get. I don't want to get away from the kids." She goes, "Why are you looking like that?" Well, what do you mean? Why am I look like that? I'm looking up there and I'm looking over here. Well, it doesn't matter which way I look. Well, you got to break my chops, no matter where I go. Leave me alone. I'm not bothering. She goes, "How would you like it if there were a bunch of new guys walking around?" I said, "Find a beach." Please. You go there. You go there. Enjoy. As oh a matter of fact, I hope you get lucky. R get something and run away from home. Run, a run off into the sunset. Oh, you're so they don't mean. Leave they don't leave me alone no matter what I do. <laughs> Jen, I don't know if you know how the rest of this family. I got my nephew and my niece. Do you know that I, they're going to do a reality show? Mm. Oh, I'm going to set up a reality show in my house. And I already got the, the, the right name for it. You know what it's called? The no dysfunctional jokes. family. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> we don't want to get into we'll, that. We'll, we'll make one stop in Staten Island. Uh, Bronx? Yeah. Any problems in the Bronx or no? Yeah, we'll go there, too. Okay. And uh, You can come to my house, too. Where they're, you know, dysfunctional family part two. <laughs> dysfunctional family part two. Now, the only one that doesn't have any problems is Mariana. Oh, now, Mariana, uh, I told her... I wanted to move in with her, but uh, I told him to come there with a sledgehammer, make another room. <laughs> like that, no. Only Valeria will take me, I know that. Tell her how much you love me, show them. How much? From here to the moon and back. Aww. <laughs> <laughs> so you know CPR, right? We're both gonna faint yeah. now. Um, <laughs> Who would you rescue take first? Take your time, please, the two of you. <laughs> Take your time. Oh, you're coming alive then? <laughs> oh, boy, oh, boy. Will I ever. <clears throat> oh, but anyway, but I didn't like the Dominican Republic. And plus where I went was at the end. You can't leave the hotel because they say if you leave, go with a guest or go with a tall bus and they bring you in town. Mm. Nobody spoke English where I was. And it started annoying me because the air condition in the room was, um, it was very humid in the room. Mm. And uh, I, I just, I didn't like, I didn't like the food. I don't like this buffet thing. Yeah, I like yeah. sitting down at a table, looking at a menu and tell somebody what, what I want. want. Yeah. I don't want to get online like they do in prison, you know, and <laughs> you know, you put food on your dish. Where's my Mariana? She, she's still awake, my baby? Mariana finally came to the show, but it's all right. That's because she got off early tonight from work. And uh, so I didn't like it, and especially my phone went dead on me. Oh. I don't mean we had no power, but I forgot to tell them again that I needed to make calls to the U.S. Mm. So I went to the front desk, and I said, you know what? Because I couldn't get in touch with them. I said, I, I need a calling card. They said, oh, no, have car, have bus. I don't want a bus, you <laughs> moron. I want a calling card. You know, El Telefono, you know? It's like Hotel Whatever. California. You can check in, but you can't check out. <laughs> Well, that's what they did in Bronx Hill. You can check in, but you can't check out. <laughs> but anyway, to make a long story short, I, um, I left the hotel about eight days before 
my time was up. Oh, wow. And uh, the, I had a hard time trying to be compensated, you know, for that time. I just said, you know what? The hell, I don't even care. Did you leave your wife there or you took her with you? I wasn't that lucky. <laughs> oh I wasn't that lucky. <clears throat> Please, don't screw up my night. <laughs> Mariana, Valeria. Uh, Nana. My, uh, Nana. My my fantasy. I can't talk about my niece. It's my niece. Gotta leave her alone. <laughs> Haven't seen her in 12 years. And they told me, everybody told me, so beautiful. You are. You are, baby. And I'm so happy she came here tonight. But anyway, that was the end of my vacation. Mm -hmm. Oh, we got a video. Oh. Do you want me to introduce Richard, her? Are we ready for that video? Yes. Oh, good. Boy, I was talking so much, I forgot all about it. <laughs> Mariana. Wait up, wait up. As soon as it starts, come here. I believe thoughts create our reality. Though life gives us challenges, we could be reactive or proactive. We are here to shine, and this is how we give thanks to life. Oh, blessed life, I'm here to shine. The hardships felt won't leave me blind. You give me hope to carry on. Give me hope to carry on. Had my trials been through it all. Flew too high before the fall. Open up to face my fears. No more time for tears. And I
shoot that? In New York, we did it in two. We did it in a, my friend's studio. If you ever need a good studio, you could borrow his studio as well. It's huge. There's for, something wrong with this one? No, it's oh. it, they're equipped for like music videos and, oh, I and see. movies. Okay. And so if you're doing things, and then the other one was uh, all over Manhattan. All over Manhattan. Yeah, like uptown and like different parts of Manhattan. Okay, so it was two, okay. It was a two-day. Oh, and my friend's bar. Oh, and awesome. then your friend's bar. Okay. And that was this year. Uh, that was uh, October of last year. Oh, great. Wow, that's unbelievable. Yeah, you know, we're going to hear I, one more song. Yeah. Unfortunately, well, we, that's going to uh, be it. Well, we, we talked out for one minute, and mm -hmm. then uh, we'll have enough time for her to do that last song. Yes. Yeah, and I just want everybody to know that hopefully by the end of next summer, like around next October or November, I might, this might be, then it might be the end of my show. But maybe... Um, How's that good news? <laughs> well, it's yeah. not so much good news because I, I might be moving down to Florida. Okay, that's good news, but you know, not, good, but not good for, for us. us. <laughs> but I'm sure Mariana's going to handle the whole thing. Hi, huh, Mariana? That's right, she will. Or Valeria, if she can't do it. Or the both of them. We'll figure it out. I'd like to take the two of them with me. <laughs> well, you're going to Florida. Oh, I'll, I'll stay, stay with Matter them. Matter of fact, I'll take the three of you with me. What? <laughs> What the hell? Kill me. <laughs> Kill me. I, I, I'm done with New York I haven't winters. got a heart attack yet, but I'll, I'm due for one. I know that. Anyway, can we get you to do one more song? Only if you ask nicely. If I ask nicely? <laughs> wait, wait, wait. Pretty please, baby. Oh, anything Pretty, for please. you. All right. How okay. can I say no? Please, thank you so much. Done. Okay. <laughs> you tell you so.
pals, yeah, that's where we'll be. It's Vinny, a friend of mine. Stand up guy from the Lower East Side. Take it from me, he's one of a kind. It's Vinny Velotar.